Welcome back, everybody, to the show. I am your host, as always, Jay Villain, aka That Villain Jay. It is just past midnight on uh, March 27th, so this means that it is my birthday. Oh, yes, it is. 327. Of course, 27 is the cube of three, which is nice. So it's three, cube, three. And uh, that's my birthday. It's nice, mathematically symmetrical, which I rather like. So we're going to do a birthday draft, ladies and gentlemen. I don't want to mess up my standing right now and ranked. I'm this. I keep teetering right on Mythic. I get one game, and then I get Naya ruined back. So I said, you know, I don't even want to risk it. I'm just going to have fun. Today I didn't do a lot of building. I'm just going to have fun for my birthday weekend. Let's do a little draft, man. We got this draft token sitting here. Let's not let it go to waste. But before we do that, I wanted you to do something for me. If you're new here, uh, if you're brand new, tenderly press that like button. Gently press that subscribe button. Or if you're old, press that uh, like button. Don't smash them. Everyone wants you to smash them. The like and subscribe button. I don't. Just tenderly push them. Um... Or else the like and subscribe will come and brutally, brutally maul you if you don't. You can join us on our stream every night at twitch.tv slash thatvillainj for all the live streaming goodness. Uh, we will be live streaming drafts every now and again. I don't normally do draft material, um, but I do occasionally. Uh, you can you can uh, come join in all the crazy live stream shenanigans and yell at me when I make the wrong picks. You can check out our Discord for all the latest news and information. Uh, we have that down in the description. Um... And, of course, this deck and all the other ones are on my Aether Hub. You can check that out in the description. Let's hit this token right here and get into it, boys. Um, don't forget to like. Like I said, we're going to fill the seat. Also, I'd like to extend a personal invitation while we're waiting for these seats to fill up uh, for you to join the channel, guys. Uh, you can join the channel now. You can come support me directly, get a bunch of cool uh, extra bonuses, special Discord roles, uh, all kind of extra stuff if you join the channel. So that's all right down there in the description. So uh, we are finding a draft table. We do not normally draft, ladies and gentlemen. Um, I mostly do standard build in case you're new. Um, but let's get this started. Uh, let's see what we're going to have tonight. I really at least want to go five wins so I can get enough gems for my next mastery pass. Uh, I do do Mastery Pass Economics. I do do economic uh, breakdowns of magic, in case you're new, um, of different things, how to get best packs, cards, stuff like that, free codes and stuff like that. Um, and I do, I'm very close to, ooh, Katos the Silent Spider, Naomi. We could do Ninja. We could, I, I don't think I can give that up. I don't think I can give that up. I gotta take that. Okiba Raid Reckoner is rated very high too, and I do like that card, but it might it might circle back. I think we have to take Kotose. I don't even think I have any of her. It's a good grab right off. Sokuzen, Crucible Defense. Papercraft Decoy. Sokuzen is recommended. Moonshell, Planner Incursion. Spell Pierce. Seven Tail Rampor, Narikzama. Ooh, okay, so what if I did, I could do Mardu, or I could do Return Enchantment. I think I like Blade Blitz Kitsune better. Um, uh, I don't think I want Sokenzu Crucible Defiance. I don't think that that's going to be right. I, and I don't know if we're going to hit enchantments. I think this is all around. If we're going to do ninjas... We could do Esper Ninjas, and I think that that's the right pick right there. Um, we're waiting for the packs to wheel, of course. Penguin Bear is holding everything up. Um, that's fantastic here. So, Network Disruptor. Hmm. Thirst for Knowledge. Greater Tanuki. I don't want that. I have no Thirst for Knowledge. Mimetic Sphere. Network Disruptor. Uh, this does enough to be a nice little one drop. Oh no. Reckoner's Bargain. I don't think that that's very good. Um, 
Diamatic Sphere. I think I'm gonna want Network Disruptor. I think a 1-1 one, one Flying 1-Drop one is gonna be okay. So I think we're gonna do Network Disruptor. Thirst for Knowledge, I don't think, I don't think we have any artifacts yet. Maybe that'll wheel back around. Air of Enlightenment, Silver Fur Master, absolutely if we're doing ninjas. Okay, we're drafting a decent ninja deck here, ladies and gentlemen. Um, we are hitting a pretty decent ninja deck. Uh, we might even be able to do an Esper Ninja. Um, yeah, I think we're actually in a pretty good spot right now. Aside from the mana base, which is the really the one thing that I'm worried about, which I think that we can probably handle, I think we're going to be okay overall. Um, Furtive Operator, Sly, Sky Swimmer Koi, um, Furtive Operator. Uh, okay, yeah, we're going to take Furtive Operative. Okay, so yeah, we are getting a Knight... We are getting a pretty decent, uh, we are getting a pretty decent ninja deck together here, boys. That's pretty cool. Uh, I think I'm gonna call it Surprise Party since it's my birthday. Uh, hey, what's up, Xylo Beast? The great Xylo Beast, Undercity Scourge. Um, I think I will take Undercity Scourge. Shrine, Steward, Enormous Energy Blade. Those are all pretty bad. It is my birthday. It is officially at midnight. It is my birthday. It is 327 is my birthday. Deck helper. Oh, no, we don't want that. Yeah, yeah, it's past midnight, so it is officially my birthday. Yeah, it's past midnight. That's why I started my stream past midnight, so I could start a birthday stream. Uh, enormous Energy B, Kami the Rest of the Deepless Shadow, Air of Enlightenment. I don't know if that's going to be any good. What's the other side of that? Is going to be a monk. Kami the Rest of the Shadow, Sword Trigger, Moon Snare, Prototype. Short circuit, any of those are good. So, uh, we'll grab that. I don't think any of them are very good. Kami of the Restless Shadows. Actually, um, you know what? We'll take a Kami of the Restless Shadows since we are doing a, uh, a Ninja and Rogue. Ooh, Tokichi Skywalker, yes. Yes. Okiba Raid Reckoner. Um Under Skitty Under City Under Skitty Surge. Uh da, 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 da. Light the Way. Yeah, we're gonna do a rogue there, of course. <clears throat> Pretty, pretty decent. I, I don't know how how good it's gonna be in the meta. I don't know the draft meta that well. I don't pay attention to it. Papercraft decoy. Um, Mecha hanger. We get another undercity. We're gonna have a few of those. That's gonna help us ramp. Um, that is gonna help us ramp a little bit. Crash boom bang. How you doing? It is the nukes. Um, the nukes. Are you a drafter, man? Are you a drafter? I don't know anything about the draft meta right now. Reckoner's Bargain, Air of Enlightenment. See, that's that Air of Enlightenment again. There's that Air of Enlightenment again. I feel like Reckoner's Bargain is not great. We might be able to grab... Yeah, uh, let's grab that. Let's grab it. I, I feel like... Kami the Wretched Shadow again. That's a Samurai. Uh, let's do that again. We are running that. Debt to the Kami. I actually really like Debt to the Kami. That's actually a very good card. Um, Aki War Paint is unnecessary. And, of course, we get a freaking land card of Forest at the end. Kami's uh, Flare at the Long Reach of Night. Oh, yes. Very, very good. Twisted Embrace is not bad either for removal. Um, Prosperous Thief isn't bad either. Um, Covert Tactician isn't bad either. 
This is direct removal, so... Uh, yeah. Well, it's a direct removal. We're not running discard. Let's do Twisted Embrace. I think we need pocket removal. I think we need pocket removal, definitely. I think that that's going to really come in handy. The Sin Dweller. Awesome, dude. That is a fucking edgy name right there, bro. I like that. Moon Dweller is, is in fact, a ninja... Return, I do like that. Acquisitions Octopus is not bad either. I believe that was a Metal Gear... Uh, I believe that was a Metal Gear boss too, by the way. Acquisitions Octopus. Um, he was a Metal Gear in Metal Gear Solid. If you're already leaving an angry comment, I'm kidding. Alright, so Nazumi Prowler, definitely. Covert Tactician is not bad. Um, but this gains lifelink and death touch, and I think that that's pretty good. So we're actually pretty Tamiyo's completion. Ooh, this is a scary one. Doesn't untap. Unforgiven one. To spirit. Searchlight companion. You are already dead. Um Air of Enlightenment again that they try to push on me. Scry. I don't think that that's that good. Unforgiven one. Number of modified creatures you control. Tamiyo's completion. I might have to go with that. It's a good lockout. Oh, ecologist terrarium. Search your battle. Search your uh, basic land card. Reveal it. That's actually not bad. That's actually not bad. Da, 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 da. Kami the Reckless Shadow, Moonsnare Prototype. Um, I don't really care about that. We can do Kami the Reckless Shadow. That returns stuff back from the dead. Now the AI doesn't like it. The, the pro says that uh, overall they say that it does help add some stuff. Planner Incision, Prodigy's Prototype, Player Playcraft Short Circuit, Reckoner Shakedown. Planner incision and loses flying. Hmm. Let's do wreck reckon or shake that. They don't like it, man, but well, why not, man? Is my birthday wish going to be to win? I missed that one prime time. Yeah, my birthday wish is going to be to win. Uh, is to become a is to become a real Magic the Gathering player. Um, Moosenair Specialist, I get. They want me to fucking have this card, I guess. It's the only fucking blue type when we were young. All right. Luckily, we have a, whole, uh, uh, a third wheel to get in the way here. <laughs> get it? A third wheel to get in the way? You guys get it? You get it, guys? A third wheel. Third wheel's get in the way, and it's going to be the third wheeling, third round of wheeling cards. You get it, guys. You, you, you guys get jokes. Oh, that's good water right there. Nothing beats a can of water. Dokushi Shadow Walker. Ooh, yeah, he's gonna be best ninja boy to come in and ninja people and ninja your loot. Um, enormous energy bank, clawing torment. Is that be a trespassers? No, okay, clawing torment. Yeah, lurking like a stalking butler. Who's holding it up again? Runic. 300 is holding it up again. Calabao. So guys, what else is going on with y'all, huh? Y'all doing good? Spell Pierce, they don't like it, but honestly, um, honestly, I'd like to have it in my cyborg. You're already dead, Reckon or Shakedown. Da -da 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 -da. I guess I'll take an already dead. 
I guess I'll take another already dead. And I will take a island because crackling emergence, why even? Why even do that? Well, I guess it does fill up my uh, auto select. All right. All right. Uh, Moon snare specialist. Wow, we got some bad stuff here. Oh, we got some real garbage, man. Invoke Calamity, I might just take that because I don't even think I have... I only own two of them. Um, Roaring Earth, they say, is good, but Lord have mercy, those are some bad stuff there. Moon Snare, I have two of them already. I don't even think I need a third one. I might just grab this for the memes, bro. I might just grab it because I want it. Just so nobody else can get it. Um, just because I don't want to have to craft it later. Lord have mercy, that was a bad early hand. See, there's the other Moon Snare Specialist right there. Um, well, that just saved, me, just saved me a potential wild. What's your new RDW, man? I want to know about it, my dude. I want to know about it. Does it go fast and burn things? Can I call it fuel and I burn? Fuel is pumping engines. Burning hard, loose, and clean. Oh, I, have, I haven't seen it. Did you post it in a Discord recently? Network Disruptor, Thirst from Knowledge. Network Disruptor. I think I'm going to go for Network Disruptor. Ooh, and I burn. Fuel is pumping engines. Burning hard, loose, and clean. Fuel in my direction. Quench my thoughts with gasoline. Soakins and smelter and blood tokens. Oh, instantly. So it's a fire blood. Fire blood. I'll keep a raid reckoner. Dokichi. We actually have two Dokichis. I might grab an Okiba Raid Reckoner just because that's such a solid card. Um Iron Apprentice. I actually want to use Iron Apprentice in some. Uh yeah. Thirst for knowledge. Thorn with applause. Slime Cormand. Brute suit. Riot. Riot. Throw back a bottle of beer. Brute suit. Riot. Riot. Planner incision. I don't think I even have any artifacts, so I don't even think I want that. Um, can't block. Clawing torment. I feel like. I feel like Clawing Torment with ninjas is going to be useful, especially in a draft scenario. There's another do, uh, Dokuchi. Iron Guard Familiar. Discover the Impossible. Um, ward. Equip Creature. This is Ward. Reconfigure 4. Hmm. I'm going to go with that. I, I have two Dekuchi familiars. Huh? Uh, Virus Beetle. Yeah. The Modern Age. Draw and discard. And then it becomes a 2-3 Vector Glider. Um, Ninja's Kunai. We got to take that. We got to take a Ninja's Kunai. Sorry. Did, 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 did. Moonfolk Puzzle Maker Thundersteel Colossus Interesting It's only Crew 2 Trample and Haste but it's expensive hmm. You are already dead I guess we'll take another one of those um, Okiba Raid Reckoner uh, da, 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 Planner Incision Moonfolk Samurai. Though they didn't have Defender, I'm going to do Planner Incision. Reckoner's Bargain. Another Dokuchi Shadow Walker. We got a bunch of them. We got a whole heaping, heaping, heaping pile. I don't even think I'm going to have a rare in this deck, to be honest. The one rare that I got was a uh, Moonsnare Prototype, sure. And what do we got on our last grab here, guys? What do we got? No, no double land. I think I passed up that shrine land, but eh. I got Ecologist Terrarium. 
Um, so that's fun. What are we waiting for here? Okay, pack coming up. And, okay, yeah, Aki Firekeeper. All right, I'm done, ladies and gentlemen. All right. Excelente. So using the power of movie magic, I am going to make some cuts, and we're going to show you. We're going to trim the fat out. Right now, I'm going to tell you we can get rid of the ones that are off-color. All right? Off-color ones, they can just get right out of there. All right? All right. So we can get the off-color ones right out of the deck right there. So we got to cut 11 overall so using the power of movie magic i'm gonna go through that generally i don't want to lose everybody when i do that so making these decisions we're just gonna say one two three and and oof there it is guys that is what we're gonna run with uh this is gonna be the um surprise party because it's my birthday um and you have surprise parties on your birthday i think i spelled surprise wrong also, I think it's surprise. We're gonna put our Demir. Or do we have some ninja backs we can put on these bad boys? I don't think we have any ninja backs yet. Let's put these freaky things on there. Um, <sighs> surprise party ninjas. Okay, let's see if we can actually get it done here, boys. Um, we've got it trimmed down. I think it's actually pretty fast. 15 creatures. Um, we are snaring. We, we do have a lot of stuff here. So okay, yeah, I, I think we can do it. I, I'm gonna I'm gonna take a I'm gonna take a wild swing at it, guys. Wild swing. Um, let's see if we could actually win some games with this bad boy, and uh, get some surprise parties in. Right here we go. How's everybody feeling? Soku Zen, Smelter, and Sanguine Statue. Sack the Blood Token of Smelter, and you get a 3-1, and the statue turns into 3-3. You can do 12 damage on turn 3. That's pretty cool, my dude. It's a pretty cool combo. This is a terrible, terrible opening hand. Uh, expensive, and the ones that we have are not blue mana. Um, we will take this, though. That's not that bad. Um, let's throw that away. Okay. We can put kunai down. Ninja's kunai. There we go. Bat and Nutria. Leech Gauntlet. It's a little bit worrying. Um, okay. Sacrifice an artifact or a creature. Draw two cards. Ugh, okay, so we are going to have to get our Undercity Scourge out pretty quickly. He is going to hit us for that drain right there with that leech gauntlet. Undercity Scrounder. I guess it is Undercity Scrounder. I like to say Undercity Scourge. You know I like to mispronounce cards. Everybody knows that. Everyone knows that about Jay. Thirst for Knowledge. Okay, I thought he might be ninjaing me. turn let's put down the undercity scrounger okay if i might be able to ninjitsu the freaking dokuchi shadow walker and if he attacks um that would be cool so there's chain flail centipede first is tapped to human citizen with a base power and toughness 1-1 one, one, and can't be blocked okay no attacks all right let's see if we can swing him let's see what we got here boys it seems like he's got an equipment Seems like he's got an equipment type thing going on here. But I think if I if I uh if I bring in Dokuchi Shadow Walker, 
he's he's gonna take a hard hit. Ooh, okay. A shrine. So he's going to go undercover. He can't be blocked. We freaking ninja him in. We hit him with the Big Bang. There we go. Futurist operative. Not bad. Tricky card right there. A little expensive, but tricky. I think I'm going to throw that kunai at. He's going to reconfigure. Interesting. Um, okay, so it's going to get 4 4. Ooh, it's a big hit right there, boy. Ooh, that's a mighty big hit right there, boy. Boy, that's a mighty big hit there, boy. That's a big old crawdad there, boy. Uh, I'm going to have to pop somebody. So that's going to be 10 damage. I'm going to block that, and he's going to have to hit me. Boof, boof, boof. Okay. Uh, let's do. Um, let's do. Let's do. We're gonna have to pop that leech gauntlet. Really, is what we're gonna have to do here. So if we do Undercity Scrounger, we can't tap it. So we do have to put it on that. Okay, another fucking leech gauntlet. God damn it. Oof, he got a good freaking he got a good freaking setup here. Got a good freaking setup here. Probably gonna ninja somebody in. Yeah, he's really kicking our ass here. Two leech gauntlets, two chain flails, and a fucking death toucher, man. Yeah, he's gonna he's gonna ninja somebody in. I figured that much. I figured as much. Uh, so much fucking life gain off the off the muscle too. So much life gain off the off the muscle. Okay, so we're going to do that. We're going to do that. Okay, I think we're pretty much screwed anyway. He's got an absolute handful of cards there. So I wouldn't be surprised if he has tons and tons and tons and tons of removal. Um... I would not be shocked if he if he just has an absolute load of removal just to fucking just to fucking destroy shit with like crazy. 
Go Shinto. Okay, that's what he's going to use is Go Shinto. Interesting. Okay, now now we might be uh now we might be on to some guys. We got a removal card. I gotta destroy those chain flails, bro. Those those things are killing me, man. Let me do that. Is that an instant? Yeah, no attacks. Let's hold steady. He's still got a handful of cards. If he does try to hit a removal, I can hit a Reckoner's Bargain on whoever he tries to pop. Uh, he's probably going to swing in with Goshinto. Oh, he's going to swing with everybody. Okay. Um, all right. Good for you, bro. Might try to he might try to flash somebody in here. I can still hit Reckoners to get the life back, so let's see if he flashes. It's gonna be a ninjutsu right there. There we go. Silver for master, very nice. It's gonna short circuit. Gets negative three. Okay, so if it's gonna die and it can't kill him, we might as well sack it to get the cards. And of course we got a bunch of crap, okay. We do have the spell pierce. Uh, unfortunately, he's got a ton of mana, so I don't think it's gonna matter. Um, so we're gonna hold steady and go on the block there. And turn. Well, we could have attacked and untapped with him. That was stupid. I haven't played with Furtive. Futurist Operative. Reckoner Shakedown. Reveal. Okay. Um, you may choose a non-land card from it if you do the player chooses. All right, let's let's just kind of spell spell pierce it. He's gonna he's gonna pick it to discard anyway. So. Um. And so let's just locks him out of his uh, just locks him out of his ability right there. turn hung it on there okay let's put that in oh you can't block it is one of those boys futurist operative goes in kerbango we are able to put him back down for a nice block beef right there okay all right we're back in the game boys not much Game Boys. Yeah, you guys remember the Game Boy? I had a gray brick Game Boy. I had a Game Boy Color, and I had a Game Boy Advance. Oh, man, he gets to return to Ninja Rogue. See, that's why I like Kami Wrestle Shadow. That's actually a decent reason why they have Kami Wrestle Shadow right there, man. I'll keep it Raid Reckoner. Very much so. Let's swing, man. Let's 
Let's untap him. There we go. Stumpha! <coughs> we are drafting on my birthday, Stumpha. How you doing, my dude? This is an epic ninja battle right here. We are having a ninja clan wars right now. Ninja clan wars are literally going on as we speak, guys. Ninja war clans are happening currently. We got to, um, we got to block silver fur, unfortunately. I, I don't know what's going to happen to my furtive operative, but. <clears throat> Lethal exploit, yeah. I figured as much, but we, we couldn't, we couldn't risk the, uh, not doing it. Hey, Sumbro Beetle, how you doing, my dude? Moon Circuit Hacker coming in for three. This is a tough game. Yeah, man, this is a... Uh, it's not easy. Virus Beetle, I have nothing. You should have held on to that. Uh, debt to the Kami. Exile a creature you control, my dude. Thank you, Sumbro Beetle. Thank you for following, Sumbro Beetle. Um, didn't even see you follow there, my guy. I've been so locked in on this game, bro. This is a fucking, the first draft game that I have, and it is absolute freaking, ugh, it is tough as jerky right now, man. Down to the, down to the, we've been playing this game, this, this, this particular game, um, of the first draft game it is, it's been going on for 16 minutes. Ooh, and that's for, gonna be for the five right there, man, the dude hits the clutch card right there. Good, good game, man, if that don't make for good content, I don't know what does, bro. He was at like 25 and I was at 6 and I fought my way back. Uh, first loss though. Uh, we haven't won yet. Um, we had absolute freaking terrible. We had to mulligan twice I think. Once or twice. I don't know. Uh, bad opener but hey I like to run it on two wheels man. So we get our, we knock off our first loss. No wins. Let's see if we can let's see if we can actually get up on the board guys. I don't want to be humiliated. That's all I, uh, all I want. Um, welcome, Sumbro Beetle. You know me from YouTube, or are you just coming in to hang out, my dude? Because if not, I am a uh, YouTuber. You can check that out right there, my guy. Um, okay, Cloying Torment. Well, I'm going familiar. We, yeah, we got a pretty good ramp here. Network Disruptor. Okay, let me do that. Next, I'm gonna hold on to that so I can tap something. Okay, spell pierce. Um, I'm gonna hold on. I'm gonna try to play defensively, ninjas, right here. Realm Lord, he is freaking silver. Let's see what he tries to do here. I don't want that. Yeah, I don't. I don't like you playing that card. There you go. That's that's for suckers, bro. Um, okay, so let's do that. Let's do Arm Guard Familiar. All right. Let's do that. Um, welcome, Sunbro Beetle. Uh, either way. Bronze Plate Boar. Uh, what if instead I tormented Bronze Plate Boar? With terrible thoughts. Moon Snare Specialist. Let's ninja you in. Okay. We're really on top of this guy, which I like. There's another brown plate boar. Um, so let's put down that. Um, let's make sure that that can't attack. Put down arm guard familiar. 
Well, he can attack. He just can't block. He's got Torment. And he loses a life. He's going to swing. No. Oh, he's going to ninja a big boy in, huh? Very nice. And we got mana. I don't think I need this much mana, bro. Honestly, man. I honestly do not think I need this much mana. Two more hits and he's down. Question is, am I going to be able to get him off? Explosive entry. It's got Ward 2. I'm running 15, and you know what? I think I probably only need 14 because I'm getting overmanned really bad. Hit, hit. Okay. He can kill Kanye the Restless Shadow. Fifty, yeah, fifteen is already low, but I'm running fairly. I'm running fairly high, uh, expensive stuff. But damn, I mean, grave lighter. Okay, draw a card if a guy died this turn. Okay, that's the familiar. keep flooding out man i 13 13 cards and seven of them in mana man I, I can't win on six cards dude for real like i can't uh that's gonna be seven Instant, yeah, first strike. He's gonna pop me out. He's gonna hit over him down to two. Oh, god damn, man. If I, it's another fucking mana. It's a ninjutsu with lifelink. It's another fucking mana. I, I gotta go down on mana, bro. That's all I've fucking drawn. That's all I've drawn, man. I'm about to lose the whole fucking draft because of mana. I'm sorry, I gotta go down on mana. I know the fucking drafters. You can't run 14 mana in your draft. Uh, 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 I, I, every game, the, the last game too, I fucking flooded out on mana, bro. Uh, 15 mana for this deck, I, it's just too much. I haven't won a single game yet. And I get him down, but I, my, my card draw is just fucking terrible. Um, I might have to add another fucking Undercity Scrounger. Um... 
14. I'm going to have to do 14 mana, man. I'm going to have to do 14 mana. And probably add another Undercity's Grounder. Let's try that. I, I really don't want to have to fucking go total fucking loss here. Move silently. Okay, well, maybe they're running a ninja deck too. Arm guard familiar network disruptor. I got no black mana in my hand. Um That's a little bit better. That's a little bit better. Let's throw one of those away. Uh let's do that. Network Disruptor, they're going to do that. Okay. Can't block, they're going to tap that. All right, yeah, that's fine. All right, we're going to put down Arm Guard Familiar. I think we could probably spell pierce whatever he's got coming out. Hey, Xyla Beast. Well, thank you for coming by, Xyla Beast. Either way. Either way, Xyla Beast. You're big tired. No problem there. Hockey War Paint. I don't care about him doing the damage. That's not important. Clawing Torment on him. Thank you so much, Zylo. I really appreciate it. Let's Clawing Torment that lady. Let's Arm Guard Familiar. Let's swing in with Nizumi Prowler. And we have a Spell Pierce ready to go. Um, in case he tries to throw something big at us. Cackling Emergence. Uh, with Haste, it's still a land. If Enchanted Land will be destroyed. Cackling Emergence. Um, do I want to... I'm going to counterspell it. That, that's an instant. Okay. Furtive. Let's put Furtive Operative down. Let's swing in. I'm gonna lose a life there. We can hit that to the Kami. But I want that. I want that Watch McCall to keep working on him. Dramatist Puppet. Interesting. Put one kind of counter on. Or remove one kind of counter. Okay. Alright. Silver Fur Master. Definitely. Definitely. Um, we're going to push in with... Want to push in with furtive operative? Boom. Yeah, we'll do one damage. Gonna lose one life. He's down to five. Okay. Hmm. 
Now, if I put Arm Guard Familiar on Futurist Op... Ooh, Tezzeret. Oof. Oof. It's gonna be tough. It's gonna be tough right there. Futurist Operative. The Silent Spider. There's Kotose. Um, Dead to the Kami. Target Enchantment they control. Okay, so what if we put... So, Clawing Torment is going to kill him next turn. Can he do 10 day? He can do 7 damage to me. Can he do 10 damage to me right now? That's going to be what it's coming down to. And I feel like if he could have done 10 damage to me, he'd have done it already. Um, I feel like if he could have done 10 damage to me, he'd have done it already. I'm sweating bullets over here. Sweating bullets. Literal ammunition is plopping off of me. Yep, and that's 10 damage. My God, that is a complete, utter failure draft right there, man. I shouldn't have attacked with both. Why did I do that? Oh my God, I am a, such a fucking failure. Oh my God, I am a fucking failure. Those were 45 caliber fucking bullets dripping off of me right there, man. Total fucking failure of a draft there. Zero for zero, man. I got nothing. 50 gems in one pack. Jack shit. I, why did I attack there, man? What a fucking idiot I am. Why did I, why did I not leave a fucking blocker? If I knew he was going to die next turn. Why did I not just take it and fucking... <sighs> I'm so fucking bad at drafting, bro. Holy shit. Well, I'm going to leave it there, guys. The humiliation stinks. It stinks, man. Holy shit, man. What an awful night. What a, what a great way to spend my birthday, too. Ah, leave a, leave a like, man. I'm, I'm bad. I'm, I'm bad. I get so nervous in drafting, bro. When I know I'm going to get kicked out, I, I can't fucking play for shit, man. When I know I have flexibility, I'm much more relaxed. But that do or die shit, man, I panic. I can't, I can't handle the stress. For real. For real, man. I can't handle the stress. I fucking, I crack under that shit, bro. I absolutely fucking crack under that shit. When it's do or die moments like that, I, I panic and misplay. I, I, I play much, much better when I'm relaxed.